Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be showing you my shopping finds because I found a lot of shit on Shopee. The first item I found on Shopee is, this, is in this little pouch that I made. I knitted this like ages ago for no reason and it serves a purpose now. But that is not the thing I bought, it's in here. So, this is a stack of fake tattoos. Okay, let me just, the first one, okay. So I wanted this fake tattoo that I found of this Care Bear. Yeah, I wanted this one, but this does not come alone, like this does not come with itself. So when I bought this, I automatically bought like 64 other ones, you know what I mean? Like it's a pack. So when I got this, I also got like everything else. And some of these are really weird. Some of these are really weird. Let me just, here. This one, their words, it says love, rich, cherish, ego. Like, why would I want it? Why would I want like ego tattooed on me? Just, they're really weird. Some of them are really, really weird. Some of them are like cute. Some of them I also found like these are the colored packs. These ones on the front are like the colored ones. And then on the back, I also found like um, scorpions, fake scars. This one says, what does this say? Keep calm. Need that to be honest. I bought I bought this just for this, and I haven't used it. And I've had this for like. Two years, maybe. I bought this right before before the pandemic. Fake tattoos. The next adorable item I got from Shopee. This. This bag. The straps aren't the best. They're like, this one's plastic. And it's just really, really bad, the straps. But the actual bag, bag itself is like pretty damn good, I guess. For the price, I don't even know what the price is. It was relatively cheap for this. So I got this. I barely use it, but I have it. Anyway, next item. This next item is not particularly weird in a sense because I'm sure other people across the world will have this just anywhere, like Amazon and stuff. But here in Indonesia, it's really expensive. Like shipping is expensive. Everything is expensive. So when I found this Cards Against Humanity, I immediately bought it, put it in my cart and bought it. It's the actual like actual cards because, okay, so for context, I am a sophomore in university right now and I've always wanted like the real thing, the real pack of these since I was in seventh grade. Yeah, seventh grade. So back in seventh grade, yeah, really bad by the way, seventh grade playing this game. Like why would I do that? But we did. We, as in me and my friends at school, we played this game. A, uh, this party game for horrible people so we played this game but since we didn't have the actual cards I myself like I did this physically I printed out the cards and cut them it was like little small squares of these like these cards like these cards I cut them into squares and I printed them no way, I printed them and I cut them. And then we played it. 
up until like a year ago when I bought this and when I actually like actually bought it I was so excited because what the hell I finally have it the real thing the next item is this it's a mini wireless keyboard like genuinely really thin really small like the keypads they're really tiny especially this part like they're small small but it works obviously it's made out of cheap material like you can you can, you can feel it but it works so it's also bluetooth so and i use this for my ipad let's just try it we're just on this this notebook for my class but it's okay let's try this let's turn it on first of all and then you connect it to your bluetooth it's connected now you can just type whatever you want let's type hello my name is gisty it works very simple works well like genuinely I would consider this something that I would buy, like genuinely buy. I would consider this a really good purchase for me because when I don't want to carry this thing around, I'll just carry this and this and put it, put them inside my bag, and they're way less um, heavy than this one, even though this is also not that heavy. But if I just want to bring these. Then I'll just bring these. Fifth item, final item. Juggling balls. <laughs> They're really squishy and it's just a good way to try. I, ha I don't actually know how to juggle. Like I'm in the process of learning how to juggle. I've been in the process of learning how to juggle for two years now and I haven't done anything like i don't honestly i forgot about these i forgot these uh existed i forgot i bought these for the sole purpose of learning how to juggle but i haven't yet and it has been two years since i bought it i'll learn it i just don't know when because right now my hobbies include crochet that's it but maybe juggling i'll probably learn it on video or something but i have them got them from shopee good quality all right all right guys that's it for this video i have five items that i just showed you and i have a lot more so i'm going to keep doing these videos because why not show the weird that i bought from Shopee because I genuinely think that I bought like an extensive amount of items from Shopee that I don't need but I have them in my room and it just keeps on adding up so yeah maybe I'll do a clothing one too I got a lot of stuff from Shopee that's clothing wise thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe press the like button and also the bell so you can get notified every time I post I love you Mwah.